we continued our route in search of the Amontillado. We passed through a range of low arches, descended, passed on, and descending again arrived at a deep crypt, in which the foulness of the air caused our flambeau rather to glow than flame. In the most remote end of the crypt, there appeared another, less spacious. Its walls had been lined with human remains, piled to the vault overhead, in the fashion of the great catacombs of Paris. Three sides of this interior crypt were still ornamented in this manner. From the fourth side, the bones had been thrown down and lay promiscuously upon the earth, forming at one point a mound of some size 